Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. That's it for Arabic. This tutorial is an extension of the drawing application that we made. It's just it just adds an undo button as early 14 July 1986 I think suggested that he wanted an undo button. So why not? I just launched uh, Eclipse after being closed for years now. Uh, I've been into iPhone development if you're interested and curious. I don't even remember where the main th method was. It should be here in the frame. Yes, it is. Okay, let's see what we have. Of course, this part is in English because it was suggested by someone who apparently speaks English. So. It makes sense, right? Mm, it still works even after years of development. That's software engineering for you guys. No expiry date. Okay, so an undo button. How about we add it over the top here? And I repeat, I have nothing prepared beforehand. I'm just uh, thinking as I go through. Uh, I think it was the control panel. Uh, fresh. No, the control panel is actually the thing right he down here. Okay. Then it should be in the frame, I think. Do you see J buttons? Yes, there's main buttons. Equals four. Let's make it five. And names of I, where's names? There it is. Let's add new, open, save, and undo right there. And this is a sloppy way of writing. Let's do it names.length. This is more generic, isn't it? Okay. So we added this. Let's see if it works. This is called rapid prototyping from what I learned from software engineering. Yes, two years passed since I last made it tutorial, so you should expect some uh shucks. I think that was an exception. So you should expect some improvement, I mean. Okay, it just closes without even giving a warning message. Don't mind my blabbering because uh, apparently when you, as you go further into college, all you, the, the thing that you really learn from college is to talk more and as some of my respectful doctors like to say, it makes people think you're you have more knowledge, but it's just talking more about the exact same thing. Oh, so here it is. As you see, main buttons of three, system exit. So it replaced uh, the exit button. So let's wait. Why, why isn't it else if? I think this should be else if. It's much safer if we forgot to do something okay so else if e dot get source where is our control space equal equal mean buttons control space of three and let's make this four which is the exit and this is undo all right, uh, hmm. what do we want to do? We want to talk to the canvas. We have an instance of the canvas. We want the canvas to undo. So obviously what we'll do is canvas dot undo. Unfortunately, it is not defined, so 
we'll go over to the canvas and define this undo method. Mm, we'll define it uh, right before clear because since it's written as last and we put here public uh, void undo and um, obviously we, what we'll like to do is shapes dot remove Unfortunately, in Objective C, if anybody here knows Objective C, there is array dot remove last object, which is a very convenient method. But here we have to do shapes dot remove the index, which is shapes dot length. No dot size. This is a linked list, isn't it? Yes, minus one. So if we have a linked list of size 10, we would like 10 minus 1, which is 9, the object at index 9 to be removed. But since the user of this application might be, let's say, unclever enough to realize that he didn't do anything in order to undo or didn't draw anything, so let's say if add an if statement uh, shapes dot length equally dot size then. okay that's better equal equals zero j option pane dot show message dialog uh, no this was I think the title maybe, or the message, I'm not sure. Uh, let's assume it's the title and say here you didn't even start drawing. And let's give him this face which will make him hate himself. So j option pain dot uh, an error message okay uh, we're not done here we have to say else if the size is not zero do your stuff now let's check if it works I hope it does if it doesn't uh, it means more work for me let's see undo error you didn't even start drawing. Okay, we swapped the title message and the body of the message. Okay, uh, by the way, today is my first day at college in the fall semester of 2011 and 2012, and so far my doctors are awesome, and that's why I'm as you as I sound happy okay uh, let's see undo error you didn't even start drawing okay uh, let's draw a black rectangle and then a blue not filled circle right here let's say undo uh, okay, we have to say redraw. I hope you are with me. What we did was we removed the shape from the linked list, but we didn't tell the canvas to redraw itself or repaint. I think it was repaint. Okay. Now it should work better. Undo. No, it didn't. As you can see, even though it doesn't undo immediately, but it uh, eventually uh, removes that object. But I forgot how we redraw the canvas. How did we do that? Uh, let me try something out. Undo, draw two shapes, undo to remove the, first, the second shape. 
undo it removes the first shape and uh, it removed did you see what just happened this is another form of debugging look when we draw oh let's let's make this clear new and we draw a black circle and we draw then a yellow circle then we draw a green circle now watch undo nothing happened another undo the yellow circle disappeared which was the second one another undo the third one disappeared but this guy is still there okay it means that uh, <laughs> I'm not sure what it means but it should mean that the repaint is too early but it isn't how about we teach you debugging in this uh, so to debug you first have to press this little bug I'm not sure it, why they put a bug it should be a debug which means removes bugs but okay it will hit a breakpoint but we're not interested in it right now so we will resume resume again and it should start okay uh, let's remove it for now and resume and we draw a few shapes let's re-add re-add how about that uh, the breakpoint and say undo it will first go to the undo method removes the object step over now let's see if it is actually removed yes it is as you can see the size is two and there are two rectangles okay that's good now let's resume and it actually goes to the paint components uh, let's see look it's empty now because as we said super paint components clears the canvas and then now we iterate over all the shapes so we get the first shape we set the color and we draw it let's see if it's drawn yes it is drawn now we go over to this uh-huh I finally realized why the last shape is drawn as you can see we <laughs> damn it's just a stupid uh, problem we just removed it from the array then unfortunately we have the temp set so it starts drawing the temp which ends up drawing the black square the last one that's why it's, it stayed while the others were wiped out when we undo it, uh, undo it more than one time let's remove the breakpoints they aren't necessary anymore and let's set temp equal null I hope you got the mistake it's because when we removed it we didn't set null uh, temp to null and temp is our um, temporary variable shape that it, it should hold uh, the shape that's being uh, up updated or drawn or something uh, okay this was a design mistake it should be null before we implement undo uh, and finally or hopefully it works now as you can see we hit undo undo and an exception is thrown damn it uh, why is an exception thrown a no pointer exception r equals temp uh, we can't set it to null okay we set it to a new rect that is equivalent to an empty shape and not null null is not empty it is non-existent which causes problems if it didn't work this time tough luck you're on your own no I'm just kidding it should work it must work uh, okay circle green 
black rectangle okay uh, undo yes look no exceptions nothing hidden undo 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 you didn't even start drawing okay draw 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 undo draw more undo draw even more undo 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 so I hope you find it, found it useful if you did and you're not Ali please uh, give Ali some thanks because he's the one who suggested this tutorial and as a well, what do you call it uh, as a thank you to Ali let's draw his name Ali from Norway I think and this is a contribution to you I hope you liked it I hope I hope you found it useful I hope you're not just copying the code for homework <laughs> uh, and good luck undo